In the fifth aliyah of Parsha's Balak, Bilam is trying to curse the people, but he can't because Hashem told him, I'm going to let you go. But you're only allowed to say exactly what I tell you. And as Bilam gets ready to curse Klai Yisrael, Hashem changes the situation and he starts blessing the people. In the fifth aliyah, Bilam looks at Klai Yisrael and he says, There's no witchcraft. There's no sorcery in Klai Yisrael. Rashi explains, Klai Yisrael doesn't have the witchcraft and the sorcery that Bilam was used to. Klai Yisrael doesn't go with that. When Klai Yisrael needs to know what to do, what their guide is, Klai Yisrael goes to the Urim Vitumim. The Kohen Gadol had the special Urim Vitumim, and they would present the question, and the letters on the Urim Vitumim would light up, and Klai Yisrael would know exactly what to do. Now this is very strange. Klai Yisrael doesn't have sorcery. They don't have to use that type of witchcraft to figure out what to do in the future. Rather, they go into Urim Vitumim. What is so great about that comparison? I understand that they use the Urim Vitumim as opposed to witchcraft. But these are just two different ways of figuring out what to do in the future. What is going to end up working out? Why is it so crucial that Klai Yisrael chooses the Urim Vitumim over witchcraft? These are both ways of just figuring out what to do going forward. But the answer is as follows. When someone goes to witchcraft, it's a quick fix. They tell you, hey, do this, don't do this, we can see the future, and this is going to work out, and the following won't. When someone goes to the Urim Vitumim, there's a lot more involved. Someone goes to the Kain Gadol, someone goes to the Navi, and they say, what does HaKadosh Baruch Hu want me to do in the future? What is going to work and what is not going to work? The Urim Vitumim, the Navi, they don't just say, do this, don't do that. We are guided, Al Piderech HaTorah. HaKadosh Baruch Hu sends us a direct message. The following needs to be done, but the following needs to be corrected. The wrong things are being transgressed. Improvement needs to be made. These are, are we're given a task, not just a directive what to do going forward. It's not easy to do that because we're not just given a simple do this. We're given do this and fix the following. Repent, get closer to HaKadosh Baruch Hu. Those are not very popular. Because in general, people don't like hearing about the things they need to change. We like the quick fix. When Bilam went to Klai Yisrael, he recognized Klai Yisrael doesn't just take the quick fix. They don't just do this, do that. We're willing to take rebuke. We're willing to take feedback and make the necessary changes. We're not going for the quick witchcraft. We go the real way. The Urm Vitumim. We're shown what HaKadosh Baruch Hu wants us to fix, what HaKadosh Baruch Hu wants us to change, and we make the necessary changes.